Hello, in this video I will be testing out the Evernote app as requested by one of the comments uh, from a previous video. Um, this will be the actual app from the Play Store uh, on a Asus Chromebook Flip uh, with 4 gigs of RAM. Uh, so I already, uh, you can see I already gone ahead and installed this. Um, I guess a note on also on another comment is I believe these are being stored to the SSD on the uh, actual machine itself and uh, there doesn't seem to be an option to store it in an external SD card which I do have on this uh, uh, Chromebook I have a 32 gig installed but um, even when you install the apps you can't even see where they're being installed or where they're located and on Reddit forums I read uh, people are using other softwares or tools and they can't really locate the files themselves this is a development tool version, so I'm sure that will change in the future. All right, so let's go ahead and go try to access the actual app itself. Um, I was using the Evernote extension um, before, and you can see it doesn't really specify uh, which one is which. So I think uh, this one is the Evernote app itself. Yeah, you can see it here. It's the app itself as the upgrade account, the uh, extension has some soft keys at the bottom over here all right so these are some of the notes I took at the uh, TCA uh, conference in Austin Texas and you can see it's everything's right here you can access the notes um, I think it's running a little bit slow because I'm also uh, screencasting with the TechSmith extension so that might be uh, because of the lag usually it's a little bit faster when I'm not doing the screen capture but you can see you can access the notes. Um, you would be able to create a note as well. You can make it full screen here. Uh, I'll just do a little quick text note. Um, all right, so here testing out the ever note app. Chrome OS. All right, everything seems to work. I guess I could attach a picture. I am mean, in a dark room, so if I take a picture here, it's going to be pretty bad. Then, and the quality of the actual Chromebook, uh, Chromebook there is pretty bad as well. And there it is. We'll save it. Um, all right, so... It's done, right? That's it. The only thing I will not be able to verify is if um, the offline functionality of Evernote works with this app. I do not have a premium account, so uh, someone else will have to test that out. All right, so that was just a uh, quick overview of how the Evernote works. I don't know if I can do... Let's try handwriting real quick, I guess, before. All right, we'll try a new note, and uh, I'm gonna, what I'm going to try to do is I'll use a handwriting tool, and I will use the uh, touch screen capability here. Hello. Okay. So, yeah, I was able to use that um, right off the touch screen of the Chromebook flip here. So again, there is the um, syncing already synced up. Um, able to access those notes later as well. All right, that is it uh, on that. So if you have any other apps you would like me to try out, just comment at the bottom, and I'll try my best to accommodate everybody. Thank you.